Hey there, I'm Officer Blue Gun, and today we're heading over to Hinsdale, Illinois, a charming little suburb west of Chicago. So charming, in fact, that there are only about four violent crimes there every year. In such a quiet town, it wouldn't take much effort to drastically increase those numbers or account for half of the violent crime yourself. Meet the Queen of Karens, inmate number 265995, Sean Malarkey. This is Malarkey. When Sean's not cosplaying as Megan Rapino, she's allegedly trying to run her husband over with her car, and then allegedly assaulting police during the subsequent warrant arrest the next day. With just those two actions, she accounts for half of the violent annual crime in Hinsdale, all while allegedly driving drunk with her two children in the back seat after leaving the country club on the way back to her $1 million home. Now before I tell you anything more about Sean's bad habits, I need to tell you about today's sponsor, which helps replace bad habits with good habits. And that sponsor is Fume, who looks at habits a little bit differently because not everything in a habit is bad, so you don't need drastic, uncomfortable changes to get over it. Fume is an innovative, award-nominated device that does just that. Instead of electronics, it's all natural. Instead of vapor, it uses flavored air. And instead of harsh chemicals, Fume uses all natural, delicious flavors. One of my favorite things about the Fume is how tactile it is. It's got this adjustable airflow dial on it, it's also held together with magnets, so you can kind of fidget with it. It spins in your hand really nicely. It's really nice to kind of relieve some of that stress and anxiety while you're getting rid of those bad habits. Stopping is something that we put off because it's hard. But with Fume, it can be easy, enjoyable, and even fun. Fume has served over 100,000 customers and has thousands of success stories. And there's no reason that one of those success stories can't be you. Join Fume in accelerating humanity's breakup with destructive habits by getting your journey packed today. Head over to tryfume.com slash officer blue gun or scan the QR code and use code officer blue gun to get 10% off when you get the journey pack. That's tryfum.com and use code officer blue gun to save an additional 10% off of your order today. Now let's get to the video. On June 9th, 2022, the Hinsdale Police Department located Miss Malarkey after the nearby Aurora Police Department had notified them that she had left the Aurora Country Club after a swim meet. Miss Malarkey had an outstanding warrant for domestic violence after allegedly hitting her husband with a car. Hey, step out of the car right now. Get out of the car. Ma'am, we'll talk about everything, but get out of the car. Yep. 20 expedite, we're in the garage, she's closing. Ma'am, step out. Excuse me. Excuse step out. Me. No, excuse me. Step Get out. Get your hands off of me. Step out of the car right no. now. Excuse yes. No. Step out of the car. Get your hands off Get of me. Get out of the car. No. You're under arrest. No, I am not. Yes, you are. No, I am not. Yes, you are. Yes, you did. Yes, he did. Yes, you are. Get your hands off. Open this off garage door. Excuse me. Let go. No, you get your hands off of me. No. Get out of the car now. No. I will tase you if you don't get out of the car. You better take your hands off of me right now. Get your hands Michael, off of stop. me. Stop. I told you you're under arrest. Get out of the car. You are under arrest. Why? Because you have a warrant and you're wanted no. for a domestic battery. Yes, you are. Excuse me. I just sent a message and I am. Excuse me. Excuse me. Get out of the car right now. No. I told you I can handle this peacefully, but you have to get out of the car. No, you've never yeah. said that. I sent you a message. My attorney... Affirmative. I won't cough on. You... Excuse me. Did somebody... Fart? No. Nobody farted. I added the sound effects because I have the maturity of a 12-year-old. I did want to mention, though, that the pixelation in the back seat are her two children who get to see their mother act like this with the police. And yes, online legal scholars, the police can enter her garage and go after her because she has a felony warrant for domestic violence and they can chase her into her residence. Did somebody say that you could come into our house? You don't stop tugging. I'm going to tase you if you don't get No. Yes. No. You're obstructing right now. Do you no, understand No, you're that? obstructing. I'm not going to tell you again. No, I'm not going to tell you again. Get out of the car. Right. As the sergeant appears out of thin air and they extricate this woman from her vehicle, the audio cuts out. 
Now you may or may not have noticed it, but there's been a few small spots earlier in the video where the audio also cut out. And I think that anytime the children make any noise, saying anything, or probably at this point in time, screaming, the audio is redacted. Now it's super sad that the children have to witness this. However, Malarkey, Queen of the Karens, could have just given up peacefully and submitted to arrest, but no. Okay, stop kicking. You, you don't understand. One female, 1095. You did this. No, I didn't do anything. No, I didn't. Andy asked you to come out. Excuse me? Andy asked you to get out of the car. No, Andy yanked me. I yanked you because I told you you're under arrest and you refused to exit your vehicle. Yes. Are you going to step up and be cooperative? No, my attorney... Is, Are you going to stand up and be cooperative? Are you going to understand that my attorney has filed a motion to quash this? All right, can I you just stand your knee? My attorney has filed a motion have, to quash this. Has filed a motion we're going out here, this way. to quash this. You hit us, you do anything stupid towards us, we're any charge done. If you hit us, or anything, let's go. You've already hit me. No, he didn't. And look, there's a toilet. I didn't hit you. I asked you out of the car. I told you you're under arrest. Now you got a whole show for your neighbors here. You are a dick. Just, I'm not a dick. You are a dick. Jennifer. My children don't have anybody at home right now. Resume, you're going to put Kentucky my kids alone in danger? There. I need to call my attorney. I'm not getting in that car until I call my attorney. That's I'm calling my no. I'm calling my attorney. It's not gonna happen. No, I'm calling my attorney. When the time comes, right? Right? Now. No, no. I'm calling my attorney. No, I'm calling my attorney. Sit in the car. And just to clarify for those online legal scholars out there, you do not have a right to speak with an attorney mid-arrest. My children are home alone. I'm giving you an order. Sit in the car. We want to here. Are home here the car. alone. I made my family disappear. My children are home okay. alone. We will and take care of your children. No, you're not taking care of shit. I'm gonna get The help. way that you take care of somebody is throwing them down on the ground. Nobody you are your children on the ground. You are a shitty fucking human being. That's messed up. You, you throw somebody down in front of their children? What the fuck is wrong Sit with you? Sit down! I told you to get you! You, you piece of shit. You know what? You are the piece of dirt that I wouldn't piss on if you were on fire. I smell you an odor of alcohol on your breath. No, that's my piss. That's I, your piss? I'm pissing on you. Okay. Guess what? What? You're the worst part of the society. You think? I don't think so. Oh, no, I don't. I don't think so. I fucking know it. You are the worst. You take down a mother in front of her fucking children, but you are somehow fucking I think he asked you pretty politely to get out. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. Were you there? Ma'am. We'll talk about everything, but get out of the car. Sounds like you were fleeing, right? Were you there? All right, we're good. Were you there? You saw my emergency lights before you even got in the Were you there? Were you there? Like, were you bend there? Your, bend your legs. No, were you there? Bend your legs. Don't get Were you there? Ooh. Were you there? Were you I saw there? I saw when I walked in. Yeah. You're not getting out. Hey, I didn't tell you to get out of the car. Stop. Do you have your phone on you? Don't touch me. Do you have your phone on you? Get your fucking hands off me. Where's your phone? Do not. Where's your phone at? Get your. Or, uh, do not touch me. Okay. Did I ever say you. Terrell. Do. You fucker, do not touch me. Get his fucking hands off me. You Get your fucking hands off me. Cool. Hey, oh. you keep hands off me. You keep resisting. Get your I'm going to charge you with that. If you, you know what? I'm going to charge you with putting your fucking dirty ass hands on me. Stop moving. Let him take off your watch. Fuck you. You don't get to touch me. You are a disgusting piece of shit. Right, the next so time, go. no, the next time you fucking touch me. Hey, get in the car. Sit in the car. No. He doesn't get to touch me. Okay, sit in the car. In the car. car. Follow, use the words and let these are hands. Hey, get no. in the car. If you don't, you're going to get, get charged me. with obstructing. If get in the car. If he touches me right, again. Get in the car, Sean. Get your fucking hands off Sean, me. Sean, he's not even touching you. Get in the car. Oh, but he I'm did. not touching you. No, he's touched okay, me. Okay, get in the car, he's Sean. He's touched me like way more times than appropriate. Hey, will you cut the malarkey? Sean, get in you the car. You know what? No, do you know what he's done? If you trust... Stop kicking us. I'm going to kick you right in the fucking... That's mean. Don't that do that. That was a beautiful job by the sergeant dragging her in the vehicle where she's supposed to be. And also, I want to commend these officers on their absolute patience with this god-awful 
human being. She's tried just about every terrible person play in the book, and she's not done yet. You are dead. What's that? You are getting sued. No, no, what'd you say before that? You said I am dead? What do you mean by that? You are... Elaborate on it if you mean it. You, you're getting sued. When the allegedly drunk woman remembers that threatening a police officer is illegal, she goes right to modern feminist belittlement. Do you think you're cool? You can beat up a girl? Good for you. Good for Henry, you. 20, I'm transporting one female by station copy starting. Good for you. You're stronger than girl. Wow. I take it your marriage didn't work out. No! Well, that's about all I could take of Miss Malarkey. There was a little bit more footage of her being a general pain in the ass, but... I think enough is enough. If you want to see the rest of it, it's over on Blue Watch's channel. The link's down in the description below. Special thanks to Blue Watch for letting us use their video on this one today. Also, thanks to Fume for sponsoring this video. As for Miss Malarkey, well, she was charged with aggravated DUI, a third violation with having children in the car, aggravated assault, misdemeanor resisting. She was cited for transportation or possession of an open alcoholic beverage. And about a week later, she was charged with the felony of endangering the health or life of a child, a violation of a bail bond, and a misdemeanor for resisting or obstructing. The domestic violence charge was dropped. And since then, she hasn't been able to stay out of jail very well because she got picked up on April 10th and has been in custody ever since, sitting on a $50,000 bail that apparently she can't come up with 10% of to get bail bonded out. So she is currently in custody in the DuPage County Jail. Well, that's all I got for you today. I hope you enjoyed that video. And if you did, make sure you hit that like button. If you want to see another one like it, there's one right up here of a young lady acting like a jackass too. And until next time, take care of yourselves.